largest religious statue in the world is being completed by Monsieur Serras, the sculptor in Paris. The figures symbolize the Virgin and Child, and with their base, they will be 175 feet high and will weigh 1,500 tons. The sculptor reproduces his huge statue from a small model. When finished and in position, a stairway will be built inside and from the top visitors will be able to command a view of the Rhone Valley. Let's hope the view isn't spoilt by rain. If it is, you may recall the ancient village of Dignese, near Lake Maggiore, and the quaint umbrella maker's shop there. For more than a century, this part of the country has been graced by a community of experts in umbrellas and parasols. And today, the natives are showing off their magnificent collection of brollies and sunshades. When it comes to handling them, the accent is on the handle. Not so long ago, gay trimmings and gayer ornaments were all part of Milady's armory. How times have changed. And what changes time brings. Here, for instance, is a tyre which the inventor, Mr. Johns of Cardiff, claims is unpuncturable. And you can't deny he's doing his best to prove it. You'll notice, of course, that the bit goes right through. Not satisfied yet? Well, a few nails might help. The tyre's as good as ever. And the inventor says it'll keep that way for 20 years. You simply can't puncture it. Mr. Johns has travelled all over England with bike and sidecar. And has he had a puncture? Yes, he hasn't. And what is the secret of the unpuncturable tyre? Well, you can search us. He won't say.